Hello friends, in this tutorial I am going to explain how to create a table in the Oracle database. For that I am using uh, SQL uh, commands for that. So uh, we will see how to create the uh, simple table in the Oracle database. For that uh, you have to connect to the Oracle database. So simply you can click on the connection name and uh, go to the properties. Then you can see the all the informations we have given. Then click on the test. So status is success it means uh, you can connect to the database or else you can directly connect to the database by selecting this connect button so already we have connected so that uh, menu is disabled so we have connected to the database and uh, you if you want to open a new sql worksheet then click on this menu then you can open the sql worksheet okay so when you are opening the sql worksheet you have to give the proper connection name uh, in my database sql developer i have only one connection so you can see only one connection it is system so in your case if you have multiple database connections you have to create uh, select the relevant connection name okay or else you can add or edit the existing connections uh, in the sql developer so I am giving that information then it has opened the uh, SQL worksheets by connecting to the system database okay then uh, we will create a simple table it is called customers table uh, in that customers tables I have uh, ID name age address salary uh, are the columns and I have defined the uh, primary key for the ID table uh, ID column as well as after that I will insert sample uh, records for that table okay so uh, first I will create the table and uh, I will uh, <coughs> after that I will insert uh, some records for the table so in the description sections I will uh, include these uh, PLS uh, SQL commands so uh, later when you are uh, practice with this uh, uh, practice you can use those SQL queries okay so create create table my table name is customers and open bracket then first column is ID it is int and it is not null it means we can't put any uh, null value for this ID it is a mandatory column likewise you have to implement name the name uh, data type is va cha we can store up to 20 characters again it is not null After comma then we include age it is in type because we are storing numbers for the age column again it is not null and comma then address it is char sorry, 25 the type is char up to 25 characters we can store in the address there should be yes. yeah after that my last column will be salary and it is uh, salary is uh, decimal I can store 18 digits with two decimal points okay so this is the last column and also I have set the primary key for the ID ID column then close the bracket and end with semicolon come on okay after that you can execute your uh, create statement then the already table has created so it means that is very important because already we have created that customer table so if you have that customer table definitely you can't store uh, that uh, you can't create that table in your Oracle database so let's say uh, we can create customer table then you can see when you are executing
okay now uh, we have uh, complete the sql uh, command for the create statement for the customers table so now i am going to execute okay now we have uh, typed the uh, syntax to uh, okay now uh, we have uh, write the uh, sql command to create the customers table so now we will execute this command so simply you can select this uh, create statement and click on the uh, run statement button then you can see table customers created it means uh, uh, it has created the customers table in the uh, oracle database so now we will see the uh, created table in the oracle database to check that table you uh, expand this system the connection name by click on this uh, plus sign so you can see there are a lot of options available in this connections you can create tables views index package procedures functions those things lot of things we can uh, develop on top of the oracle database in the uh, next videos i will explain how to create other components so so now we will see the uh, newly created table is available under uh, tables menu okay so if you, if you expand this menu you can see there are a lot of system tables and other tables available so uh, if you uh, now still we can't see according to the alphabetical order it will display all the uh, tables but still we can't see the customer table so simply you can right click on this table menu and you can click on the refresh button okay then you can see customer table is available so if you click on this you can see there is a uh, it will open the separate window from that you can get the columns of that table the column names the date types and the nullables and date defaults column ids those informations you can take so if you have data you can check uh, uh, that data by click on this data model okay so once we insert data we will see the available data likewise if you want to get the sql query for this create statement simply you can select on this sql command and you can get your create statement for this customer table it will take some times automatically it will generating the ddl data definition language for this uh, table uh, based on your uh, computer performance it will take some time now you can see this is the uh, database generated create statement for the customer table so likewise if there is any indexes partitions you can get and the triggers we can uh, get by click on these tabs okay so now i think already we have created the uh, customers table now we will see how to insert few records to the customers table for that we have to write the insert statement in the uh, first of all we have to type this insert into customers then we have to mention uh, the column names okay id okay uh, first of all we have to write insert statements to insert data into the customers table so uh, you have to type insert into customers table then you have to mention the column name id name age comma address and salary after that you have to type values and you have to open the bracket inside that bracket you have to include your values so now i am going to insert six records so copy this line and paste six times copy this line and paste six times likewise okay 
after that you can insert these records one Okay, now we will see how to insert a uh, few records into the uh, Oracle uh, table. So for that already I have uh, uh, prepared the simple insert statement. So I will paste that uh, insert queries into the uh, SQL developer. In the uh, description sections of this video I will attach those uh, insert queries. So when you are practicing you can use those queries. So simply I will copy this command insert commands into this area and one by one I will execute okay so you can see uh, one row affected another row affected likewise I will like insert six records so, so already we have inserted six records for the customer table then we will uh, write a simple select query to retrieve the inserted data from the customers table for that I will write simple query select all from customers okay then you can click on the run statement now you can see already inserted five uh, six records available in the customer table in addition to that if you go to that customers window you can see uh, in the data window uh, data type there is no any record if you refresh this one you can see the newly inserted data will be available in the customers table okay so hope you have clear with uh, uh, how to uh, create a table in the oracle database and how to insert uh, few records into the oracle database table so uh, so if you have any questions you can put on the comment sections and uh, the relevant uh, sql queries i will uh, include in the video description thank you